<laughs> What's this? A lovely bit of glass. Very fine bit of glass below this, but beautiful object, but complicated too. Well, this is a Goethe barometer. It was not invented by Goethe himself, but he was a great collector of these, as he was of many other things of natural science. That was one of his great interests and things. To make it work, what you have to do is turn it upside down, perhaps with the help of a friend. You have to inject water in here, water with a good colour to it, red or blue or green dye. It goes round to the top of the thing and falls into the central compartment. So when you turn it back again slowly, you want to have a situation where you've got roughly half full of the coloured liquid. And of course, it'll form a balance with the colour liquid in the, in the little side arm. Now you wait for a, f a few hours and the atmosphere will change. When you get high pressure, the high pressure will come down here and push this liquid, this, this level of this side arm, further down and you'll know you're in for some good fine weather. When it goes the other way, it means low pressure and that means, well, storms and things. So it's a very fine way of predicting the weather, but more accurately, we're just telling you what the atmospheric pressure is. Fascinating. Every home should have one. As for Goethe himself, well, he was known for poetry, but he's had this great interest in science as well, so maybe the scientific interest influenced some of his poetry. Mm.